Hi everyone, I'm Matt Gask with SoundersFC.com here at Livestrong Sporting Park in Kansas City, Kansas, where on Wednesday night the Sounders have a chance to make history with their fourth straight U.S. Open Cup title. It would certainly be a very special moment, you know, special moment for the organization, for the community, for the club, you know, to do that and to win it four in a row. Uh, it'd be something, you know, as I always say to the player, it's something that, you know, you, you can, in your older ages, you can bring your grandkids and say, yeah, that's me. That's me up there. I was part of that, you know, and it's something that's going to be special and something that's going to be unique. So, uh, you know, those opportunities is what you live for as a player. Uh, what you live for uh, as a manager of a team, you know, for the for the chances to uh, to do special things. When I came here, I think that was a pretty special feeling when I won the first one. But after three years, you had the opportunity to to win the first one, you know. And obviously, we are gonna be there, running our hundred percent and having a good performance to have the opportunity to win. In Sporting Kansas City, the Sounders will meet a team that opened the season with seven straight victories. They have cooled off considerably since then, but are still one of the top teams in the league, led by the eight goals of Kai Kamara and the stellar goalkeeping of Jimmy Nielsen, who leads the league with ten shutouts. We've got an extremely tough opponent uh, tomorrow night, a team that's been playing very well over the course of the season. So, uh, you know, it's going to be a difficult task. You know, Kansas City is tough, tough team to, to be, you know. They have good play. They, they've been... Two, last two years, play good soccer. You know the the top three in the. It's confident. You know it's gonna be a tough game. It's the final. When you play the final, it's always gonna be a hard game. The Sounders themselves are carrying momentum into the final, with wins in the U.S. Open Cup, Concacaf Champions League, and a 3-0-3 record in MLS play. Seattle carries a 10-match unbeaten streak across all competitions into the final. They've never lost in 18 U.S. Open Cup matches since 2009 and have won all three of their matches in Kansas City, including a dramatic 2-1 win last year when they were the first team to win at Livestrong Sporting Park. Our group is ready to, yeah, to try to do the best in the, in the field, the, the best game that we can. And uh, we know that in front we have uh, uh, one of the best teams in the league and uh, we have to be prepared for everything and be aware of everything. The Sounders may be on the road, but hundreds of their supporters will make the trip to Kansas City, adding their voices to the chorus at LSP. The Sounders have long had success away from home, and the team has pointed to that traveling support as a key to that success. It's a reflection of our fan base. You know, I think if they could have worked out a way to charter a plane and afford to do that, there would have been even more that would have been here. If there would have been more flights available, I think more would have been here as well. Being in the finance, we represent uh, the club represent the uh, organization, represent fans, and this is one, one of the things that uh, we get as a motivation to play uh, a game like that, like you want to have tomorrow. Uh, we, have, we are playing for them and uh, for the club and the uh, organization is behind us always. When we step on the field, we play for them as well because we know they're behind us you know win lose or draw they're always there for us they're always behind us they're always supporting us and that bond between team and fans is is very important kickoffs at six o'clock pacific time you can watch the game live on gold tv if you don't currently have gold tv call your local cable provider the sounders will also have a viewing party at the georgian dragon in fremont and several others throughout the seattle area from livestrong sporting park in kansas city kansas i'm matt gash with soundersfc.com me preguntaron si podría hacer un anuncio y pensé que era porque yo juego para los Seattle Sanders. No puedo, porque mi inglés no es muy bueno. That's true. Entonces me dijeron que el anuncio era de padres, niños y familias. Eso es muy importante para mí y le dije que yo hago lo que puedo hacer. No importa cuál idioma tú hablas, hay un idioma universal que nuestros niños comprenden y necesitan. Y es el amor y el cariño de los padres. Be a good parent, a same ball in your child's life. 